Well, in many ways, of course, it's fantastic what's happening in our society, that many of us will live uh, much longer than we would have expected. And clearly, progress has been made in medical science uh, that allows us to live longer. But um, we've recently compute, com completed a major review in the House of Lords looking at all aspects of our ageing society to ask exactly that question. Uh, are we ready as a society, as individuals um, and in government and public policy terms for our ageing society? You won't be surprised to know that our conclusion was that we were woefully unprepared uh, for this uh, major social change that's happening now. And the two big challenges are how will we support ourselves financially if we're going to live longer and how will we get the sort of um, health and social care that will allow us to live independently. And our, our review of those issues showed that we have a, a major wake-up need um, in public policy terms and in public debate. And probably above all, although it's not all government's responsibility to sort these things out, we call on the government to be much clearer about what the, their analysis of the issues, uh, what does it say about the demands facing individuals and public policies and services. And you would expect to see a very clear public policy analysis on a comprehensive basis by government of this, the biggest social change we've experienced for some time. And that has not happened.